you've sold me, it creates my bond now. <laughs> we like that. Excellent. All right, so tell me, what action, adventures, and villains are in store for Bond this time? Um, many. Um, we set him up from the beginning. He's on the trail of a, uh, of a bomber who's um, been set set to, to go and disrupt, well, disrupt a, uh, uh, the financial world as much as anything. Uh, and um, he's, um, he's on the trail. They don't actually know who the boss is. Mm -hmm. You don't actually find that out in this movie. Mm -hmm. um, and um, that takes him around the world. It takes him from Madagascar to the Bahamas. Mm -hmm. um, and, um, yeah, I mean, action, yes, plenty of. <laughs> what can I, I don't know what, what to say, yes. Yeah. Lots of it. Lots of villains and mm. lots of people. Yeah, I mean, and the, and the, the, the bad guy in this movie is a guy called Le Chiffre, uh, yeah. who is, um, who, which means the number uh, in, uh, in French. And um, he's basically a, um, he's using money to try and destabilize the world's economy, yeah. basically, to, so, they, so they can take over. So, mm. what is it about this character that Ian Fleming created that men want to hang with him, women want to hang off of him, <laughs> but yet he still is, you know, s people are still fascinated with him in pop culture, but technically he's not very politically correct. No, he's not, but I mean, he's sort of, he's kind of, he's, he's, he's understandable, I think. That's sort of really a way of looking at it. He's, you know, he's not, he makes no bones about who he is and he doesn't apologize for yeah. who he is. Uh, but what I think that Ian Fleming set up from the beginning is actually something quite complicated. And plus, he's bad, you know, I mean, he's, he's sort of, he's kind of a bad man in all sorts of ways, and, and that's how he gets the job done, and that's how he sort of justifies, you know, justifies his behavior. So, this character created in the Cold War, you mm. know, basically you have a really amazing opportunity here in the mm. fact that, you know, you have full car blanche mm. on this character. Mm. So how have you updated him from the guy that we've all grown up with? Well, I didn't, I've done nothing, I've done nothing sort of, uh, well, we have done nothing sort of, uh, Self-consciously, we've, yeah. we've, we've, we 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 have got complimentary on this, and it means that we can have we, what we can do is we can discover where this guy sort of where his head is. Um, it was important that when we did it that that we were you know we're discovering somebody at the beginning of the movie who sort of really doesn't care whether he lives or dies, yeah. and he's you know he's just after the you know he's after the bad guys. But thrown into that, we have uh, we have a love story, and that was important then to sort of discover how he changed and how he was how he becomes the person we know, um, and. Um, you know, he gets his heart broken, and he gets he gets you know he gets himself torn apart a bit. So. so, is it due to that broken heart that in the past twenty Bond films that we've seen, like, is that broken heart that's created that cold, calculating spy that we've it all grown up with? It goes towards it, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Unbelievable. Mm. So this is a gadgetless movie, but even though it's a lot more modern, mm. I see laptops, I see you know implants. Mm. Well, just I mean regular stuff. Yeah. Just regular stuff, you know, implants and you know. <laughs> So special phones and the odd laptop. I mean, I mean anything, any, anything gadget-wise that's in the movie. It's really hopefully just it's too, you know it's it's plot-driven. It's not mm -hmm. it's nothing to do. It's not self-consciously a gadget. So taking Bond back to his roots, do you think it's going to basically take the mystery away from the man? I don't think so. I think it's creating a new mystery. That's the plan. Yeah. It's trying to create something that, that you know that sort of people can understand and sort of you know sort of show somebody with a fallibility. Fantastic. Thanks so much. It's been amazing. Thank you. You're fantastic. Oh, thank you so much.